this is a curry comb for a horse. So it's got nice rubber teeth on it, but it's not painful like the Furminator or anything of the same. I've got probably going to be eating hair for the next three days, but he doesn't need to be um, brushed often because he's already really soft, but he's been starting to lose his winter hair already. Oh, well, with the freaky weather we've been having. Right, Chicken Nugget? Go use your hand, Shaw. Look at me. Look. Look her. Hey. She's going to be a snob now. Hmm. And he likes that usually have to be brushed like this. Like a cat who likes to get their chin scratched. And this brush was three forty nine Canadian. But this years ago I have another one that's I think smaller or thinner. Are you being a hand shop? You bring a hand shot, look. You want me to stop now? So what I normally do is I brush this way and then I brush this way. And I've been doing that with my nails too uh, since I've got them. So he's used to it. And that helps remove a lot of <laughs> a lot of it, the loose hairs and whatnot. But when he starts um trying to chew at the brush. It's time for us to stop. Because you bing. You got iggies. You got eye nuggets. You got, you got the eye, see the teeth? You got the eye nuggets. Hmm. Molly sure. <laughs> so that was a little experience in our, in his grooming um, session. Next stop. These things. The nails. But I don't have any cookies with, with me where I am now, so we have to wait. You pay? You pay? Hey! You pay? You pay? We're not, he's not listening today.